hey guys this is Imanshu and in this video we will talk about work manager so where we can use this work manager now suppose you want to download data from the internet or other anywhere else and it is taking too much time to download it so you did not want to perform this task in your main thread so you have to do this on your background thread now work manager will simply provide you that facility that you will simply do this task in your background now in work manager we have a constraint now suppose you have to download data if your wi-fi is available so this wi-fi wi-fi is available is your constraint so if this is fulfilled then you will perform that task so work manager will simply provide us constraint so it is very good you can we can use this type of constraint in our coding part now we have a two type of work request one is one time work request second is periodic time work request means periodic work request so without wasting any time let's code so we are in our computer screen right now and first of all go to build dot get all module app level file and add this dependency on it and after that go your activity underscore main dot xml file and here add a button and uh, provide a add it to it so in my case my id is start underscore work and after that i am going to create class for our work uh, for our work so so first worker and i will i'm going to extend this class with worker and simply import this so this is our parameter context and worker params so now i am overriding function naming do work now i want to perform thread sleep for three seconds and after that i will simply make notification so this is our first worker which is our title and second is our application context and lastly we will return our result so if this thing is done correctly then my result is success and now i am going to create this make notification so okay now i'm creating this make notification function over here so here we are simply check our build version if it is greater than or equal to oreo then we will simply create this notification channel and by using this notification builder we will simply build our notification so our notification id is notification channel id is first worker and name is worker so we will simply pass over this channel id to our notification compat dot builder and it will simply build our notification that's all so this is our first worker and uh, now i'm going to make a request which is a one time so well one time work request and uh, one time work request builder and here i'm going to pass our worker class so in my case first worker class dot java and simply build this now I am attach a listener to our button so set on to listener and I will take our work manager instance so work manager get instance you can see pass our context and simply enqueue this our request so one time work request now run our emulator okay now when i'm clicking this start work you can see our notification will appear here now i'm going to attach a constant on it so well con not constructor is constraints constraint dot builder dot set record network type so network type dot unmetered basically we have a many constraint so i using this network type so this is network type unmetered means wi-fi so if our wi-fi is on then this work request will run so i will attach this constraint to our work one time work request now i'm passing this constraint I forgot to build this constant now it's fine and now I am running our emulator so when I am clicking the start work you will see our notification will appear here because our Wi-Fi is on so now I am going to run our emulator again and uh, this time 
I will off my Wi-Fi and try to perform this work so as we can know here we have a constant of Wi-Fi so if Wi-Fi is available then our worker will work if it is not it's not so okay so it is more than six seconds and it, it will not running means this thing is this constant is not fulfilled and now I am fulfilling our constant and see whether our okay so you can see here after six seconds it will simply pop up here means your work will never be ignored here your work will definitely perform if your constraint is fulfilled okay so that's all for this video